be really welcome to why not your authentic answer you know this is a magical place that i invite you to stay like and subscribe once i'm here just giving wings you know to my dreams and in the future i also hope to some other unknown talent of all people you know today we are here in this sunny beautiful day you know with this <laughs> comfortable pillow you know I just want to go random with you and think about on how relationships uh, suddenly just start to fail you know like um, you know and I think there's plenty of reasons right and but I think many relationships fail um, quite simply because we are constantly evolving you know and at a certain moment in life it may have made a lot of sense to be with someone you know however as we are constantly uh, evolving you know and at different paces different rhythms you know even with ourselves you know we have phases that which we need to develop very quickly and others that you know we just seems that we regress let's say no basically um, we simply can evolve you know at a different speed and rhythm than the other person that is with us right and besides that we can also um, evolve in a different direction you know and in a different sense let's say you know um, so then we could be even going on opposite directions that the person we are with so imagine uh, instead of being just by my side right that person is <laughs> or in front or behind or way in the side of me and you know so as this is obvious you know um, the result of this equation you know is negative for the relationship you know because it's mathematically impossible for that person as i told you to be on our side right uh, so yeah imagine he or she may be physically or um, you know uh, with us but on a deeper level we are really really distant let's say like it's like we are traveling for miles in different directions and at different speeds as i told you, you know so our dis destiny is already not synchronized and yeah it's like <laughs> instead of we meet at uh, you know the round the bell or you know at the traffic light yeah just so far away from each other you know um but yeah basically what i what we need to think is that maintaining this kind of already disconnected relationship is not only a waste of our time you know that is the most precious asset that we have um but we are also um investing um our most pressure precious precious resources in something that no longer has the same value you know so basically we are just uh, fighting you know and swimming against the current you know and then we just end up stuck without leaving the place you know which is not what we want right because we want to evolve we're gonna go with the flow so basically i think that the best solution in these scenarios instead of putting more effort putting more time you know and end up in relationships with seven years that then just end you know i think it's the best solution is just to have a, an honest conversation you know and discuss uh, possibilities you know that i think the most healthy one it's uh, just ending you know <laughs> the relationship you know but with a open talk and with an open mindset you know just uh, in a calm way and very with a very receptive mental uh, mentality you know towards everything you know because everything can really happen you know it can go very bad or it can go really good and smooth and you can even be friends you know so because i think you need to res kind of respect you know what um, what happened um between you because years of your life was was were shared with that person so doesn't make sense to just kill it so suddenly you know um so yeah um i think you just need to keep in mind that uh, the relationship with the other person is not the priority you are the priority and your 
and not just yours but also the other people well-being you know happiness and above all you know i would say your own self-love you know and the relationship with yourself you know so you know that's it there's no more precious asset at that time so then you will never regret investing time in yourself you know basically that's the, the not the hard truth but the simple truth you know but then what will happen is that you will regret very easily you know in investing in a failed and already uh, doomed you know it's like the destiny of that uh, relationship is to be doomed you know and uh, yeah, to invest in someone that has no longer that no longer enlightens you as before you know and as the opposite you know acts as a scruple you know so basically my advice is never forget to be happy to dream big and invest in making your dreams come true first as simple as that you know and yeah i feel many people you know nowadays are in relationships just because you know and just because they don't want to be alone but it's really not their dream uh, it's not the relationship they always dreamed about you know so i would say not to content yourself with just okay you know content yourself with the best for you see you see you soon in the next pillow talk it was a pleasure <laughs>